what is that my heart freeze real love all right hey y'all it's your girl empress love back with another video what's good y'all so we gonna hop right in and get into some messages all right i'm gonna have to use my other tarot deck because what deck we gonna start with i don't know i'm getting like new love so let's let's start with the truth's oracle i'm searching for a real love yeah somebody got offers coming in let's see Yeah, you could have dealt with a lot of sneaky shit in the past. And it's like, now you don't want that no more. You putting that behind you. So let's get some overall energy. What do we need to see around this new love? We're going to talk about new love, but whatever come out, come out. Let's see what's going on with this new love. This is sticking out to me. Him. Okay. I'm hearing, she got me speeding in the fast lane, better to the slow man, trying to get back to her love. But to leave, she got that good thing, she my little good thing, ask around, they know us, they know that's mine. Yeah, realization. Yeah, so you got somebody who, um, like, they realizing who the hell you are to them, yes. So you got committed and in the shadows. She got me speeding in the fast lane. Yeah, it's like somebody want to come and give you a commitment. It's like they realize they just want to fuck you is. Look, I want you. What's that I'm hearing. I want you. Yeah, see, because the family car fell in the reverse. I know y'all seen that. But I feel like somebody want to leave behind a family to come towards you. Yeah. It's like they realize that like, even though they ha they have a family with somebody else, um, it's you who they want to be committed to. You may not know this. Distracted. Yeah, I feel like you so distracted on your hustle. You ain't really worried about no relationship. But yeah, see, somebody finna come in and make an offer to you. Hurting. For some of you all, yeah, this person is hurting. They missing you. This is a past energy. I already see it. You could be somebody who, um, you could be pregnant right now. But I'm getting, it could be a masculine that got somebody pregnant that don't want to really be with them. Yeah, it's like this person ain't got no money. They might, you know, be um staying with this person for financial reasons. And then it's like they got a baby. So they don't want to leave them and then be on child support. And they ain't even got no money to pay for the shit. I feel like somebody is stuck somewhere where they really don't want to be at um due to a pregnancy they hurting behind that shit i get two more let's see collective i feel like yeah i feel like you about to have a relationship um that's going to bring you a lot of comfort. Yeah, I've seen this card twice, the family-oriented card. So I feel like you may have a child, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like this person um, is going to come in and be with you. But see, this person, they want to leave this situation. They want you, but see, they family-oriented. They're they going to stay in the situation because it's a baby involved. They gonna stay because it's a baby involved. But see, I feel like collective. You finna have somebody come in, even if you have a kid, 
who's going to come in and be um, committed to you and your child. Be very family oriented. Even if, you know, they don't have a child, they know how to um, handle a child. Yeah, I've seen single parents twice. Yeah, so you could be a single parent. I'm picking up two energies. I'm picking up a masculine who don't want to leave a person that they, that they don't want to leave. All right, collective, say your past, this masculine, right? He don't want to leave a situation. He wants you, right? He wants you. He's hurting, okay? But see, he don't want to leave that situation because this person has a child. But see, this person, this masculine don't have no money. Or this female who's pregnant may not have no money. You know what I'm saying? This masculine could be hustling, you know, he distracted because he know he have a kid on the way and see he family oriented. Also, this person could be a single father. You get what I'm saying? But either this person is a single father and he's hustling to take care of his kid because like it's like the mother don't have money or he don't have no money. And he don't want the mother to put him on some, like, child support for leaving him. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know how a female, like, they'll deal with a nigga, excuse my language, they'll deal with somebody not having nothing and being there and not helping them versus they gonna see him go be happy with somebody else. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, we might not have nothing. We both over here struggling, but I'm having this baby and you gonna stay with me type shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm recording. All right, I'm hot and I'm recording. Thank you. I love you too. So, yeah. I'm also getting collected that if you a single parent, like, see, you got a relationship coming your way. And this person going to be very family oriented. But see, this, this, this masculine, he hurting him. That's that emperor energy. He's hurting because it's like he want to come towards you. He knowing exactly who you is. This is somebody who wish they would have given you, like, I don't feel like this is somebody you have a kid with. This is somebody who has the kid outside of your relationship. I'm also getting that he knows that, um, you know, that's the that was kind of the tiebreaker for y'all to um not be together but see this person this person is still obsessed with you and you gotta move with caution because although they have somebody told they have a whole nother person a whole nother baby on the way they don't want you to know that it's something around some baby you got pregnancy family oriented and single parent so that's, it's, this situation is around some kids. Somebody is stuck in a situation because they got somebody pregnant. Yeah, they done jumped to conclusion, got themselves caught up with some shit. Got a whole baby on the way. But see, this person, they dealing with, they ain't going to let them get off, get off so easy. Nope. This person ain't going to let them get off so easy. Look, you got purify, breaking point down and the grass was fake yeah this person look you got kicked out altercation leaving it behind yeah it was like this person that they dealing with they go through a lot of bullshit they go through a lot of drama this person could be kicking them out all the time throwing their clothes out every time they get into an altercation see this person this masculine he want to leave that shit the fuck behind but see he bound to that situation because this person who he thought was it, the grass was fake, somebody he thought he could be committed to, yeah, no, that ain't it. This person ready to pack up his little shit he got left because, see, this person fucked up his clothes, could have bleached his shit. It's like he coming to his breaking point. Well, he already at his fucking breaking point. He just want to leave that shit all behind, but, see, he know. With this person being pregnant, ain't he, he ain't but so far he could go. She is on his ass. Yeah. Look, it's like he coming to a fork in the road. He want to come and apologize to you so fucking bad. 
Look, I can't make it up, but just you got upgrade, leveling up, and access denied. So that just lets me know. You know what I'm saying? Collective, you leveling up. And I feel like that may really be the icing on the cake. This person having somebody else pregnant is like, bro, we already dealt with this shit. And then you got a whole nother baby on the way. Forget if they, even if they don't have a baby on the way. But I'm getting that. With that pregnant call, somebody has a, it's not like this person has, this person could have kids, but already, but this person has a new baby coming. This person has a new baby coming and see spirit ain't gonna let you deal with that shit especially if you if this person yeah it's like this person could have had a baby mother went back with her for the kids and end up giving her another baby yeah this person watching though in the shadows they don't want you to know that this person is watching heavy but yeah they don't want you to know that they don't want you to know that. I'm telling you, either they 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 left you for somebody, like somebody they had a kid with already because they was family oriented and they didn't want to be a single parent. They didn't want to leave them to be a single parent or they got a whole new baby on the way. However it go, See, I don't have my romance angel deck no more. I don't know what happened to my shit because I'm picking up um like that children is affecting the situation um card. If you got the romance angel deck, then you know. Yeah, but you got the nine of pentacles. Two of swords, ten of cups. Yeah, I feel like somebody is like with this two of swords here. I feel like collective you you gonna have to make a decision when it comes to your happiness and what you gonna do because I feel like you in this nine of pentacles energy, your life is upgrading and it's like um you private property right now. You gotta be mindful and careful of who you allow um in your space in your area. Yeah, because see, with this Knight of Wands and this Hangman energy, it's like you gotta you gonna have to look at shit from a higher perspective because I'm getting that somebody is in this Knight of Wands energy. Like you know, Knight of Wands is like fast, fiery, passionate, and it's like you gotta see where that energy is coming from because you gotta remember. We see the financially strapped card out there. So you got to be mindful. People ain't, everybody ain't who they say they is. Look, this emperor coming out. I see the six of swords, the emperor. The ace of pentacles came out too. Yeah, see, somebody want to start a new beginning with you. You got the Knight of Swords, the Three of Swords, the Four of Cups, and the Ace of the Eight of Pentacles. It's like, yeah, I feel like they hurting because it's like somebody is trying to come in fast with this Knight of, Knight of Swords. They angry and they real impulsive. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like you ain't really paying them no mind with this Four of Cups. It's like you working. This person will come and try to offer you a cup of love. It's like, yeah. I can't make it up. You got 666. It's like balance is coming in this situation. You know what I'm saying? It's like you had to move the calmer waters. Look, I see the eight of cups too. Yeah, somebody had to leave something alone. And I feel like this Six of Cups, this past energy is like seeing you in your glow up. And they don't really like it. They don't really like it. But see, I feel like this new beginning is the justice you deserve. This person got a lot of shit going on. They got a whole baby on the way. It's a lot. Let me get a few of these. Um, 
the hidden truth oracle then we gonna close it out what is this message what is him this person who got a baby on the way worrying about the collective and what the collective got going on they bound to that kind of situation baby they is bound yeah so many things remind me of you i'm telling you this person is hurt they hurt It's like, I'm telling you, and it's just like the, the person that they have having a baby with is not it. It's like this person don't parent how you parent. This person, they they not intact. You know, this he regret doing that shit. If he ain't regret fucking love, this pregnancy made him regret all of it. From the beginning to the end. I look for you everywhere. Yeah, it's like he watched how she parent. Like, nah, my collective, my divine feminine one, wouldn't have did that. Just how you handle life, period. This person is not that. And, and, and this, 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 this divine masculine, or whatever you want to call him, because what he going through ain't so divine. But, um, he, he, he just... I'll say one more. He, he. Look, I left you before you could leave me. You came closer than anyone. I want to tell you how I feel. Yeah, this person. The shit that they going through. This this might be the information where they saying, but it was another read. And it's like they wanted to come and talk to you. It, it's like so much going on. They feel like only you could help them in this situation. This might be, you know, that. Because whoever it is, somebody asked somebody divine masculine or whatever y'all, you know, want to label him as. But this person, um, you know, that's that, that's that karmic cycle they're going to have to go through, you know, having a baby and having to deal with somebody for 18 years. Or, you know, until that child is of age because of the decision you decided to make. You can't be mad at nobody but yourself. So, that is the reason. I mean, that is the reason. But that is the reason. See, collective, your whole life is, is leveling up and upgrading. Okay? Like, access is denied. Too, not too many people can get in. So... This person is bound to this shit. I'm getting, even if this is your baby father who left you for, um, who left you and got with somebody else, they regret doing that shit. They left you to be a single parent. Now they get with somebody who ain't half as a mother as you. Okay? This mother could have even left them. To be a fucking single father. So now, this person sitting there taking care of their kid. Or oh, that's what could happen if she ain't pre if she's still pregnant. This comment gonna fuck around and lead this man to take care of this baby by his damn self. But um, that is the message that I have for you all. And until next time. Mm -hmm.